we're going to learn today is about activities or hobbies, things we like to do on a daily basis, like sports, um, hobbies like cooking, maybe artistic activities, okay? So let's go over the vocabulary. Play baseball. Make arts and crafts. Do karate. Make a meal. Go swimming. Make a painting. Play tennis. Do yoga. Go horseback riding. Do gymnastics. Go hiking. Play video games. Okay? So, that was the vocabulary. You can see how we use the modal verbs can, make, do, or go. Okay, this is the second grammar topic. Okay, object pronouns. We have our subject pronouns. As you can see, we have I, you, he, she, it, we, and they. Those are subject pronouns that replace the name of a person in a sentence, okay? Then we have object pronouns. Object pronouns, we use them instead of noun phrases. When it is clear what or who you are talking about, okay? So, for example, we have, I like that green dress. You have your object that is the green dress. So, we're going to replace it. Instead of saying, how much is that green dress? Again, you can replace it with it, okay? And then we have the second example. There's Tanya. Ask her if she has your book, okay? So, in the second sentence, we are talking about Tanya. Tanya is a she on your subject pronoun. Let me underline that, okay? So, we have Tanya, okay? Tanya is a girl, so it would be a she. She becomes her. So now, ask her if she has your book, okay? The same applies for that green dress. That green dress is an object. An object would be it, and for object pronouns, it becomes it. It stays the same, okay? So, I'm going to go ahead to the next slide. I'm just going to erase. Perfect, okay? So, let's go to the next slide. Okay, examples. I'm just going to put this over here. We have... Number one, I sent my father an email. Who are we talking about? That is step number one. Identify the subject. Right? Identify the subject. Who are we talking about? And then replace it with an object pronoun. In this sentence, who are we talking about? We're talking about my father. Okay? So... Okay, I don't know what's happening here. Let's see. So, I sent him an email. We have him as object pronoun. We replace it. Let's see another example. We showed Lisa the movie. Who are we talking about? We're talking about Lisa. Lisa is a girl. So, we're going to replace it with her. We showed her the movie. Let's see another example. Gabby gave Tom and I a birthday cake. In this sentence, we're talking about Tom and I. 
Even though Gavi can be identified as a subject or as a person, the main sentence revolves around Tom and I. So, Tom and I is we. We changes for us. Gavi gave us a birthday cake. And the last example. That basketball belongs to John and Rachel. Who are we talking about? John and Rachel. Therefore, the basketball belongs to them. Okay? Um.